Spring cleaning is here, and Appalachian Wireless has the deal to get you started. Get a Samsung Galaxy S8 for a penny or a Galaxy S8 Plus for only $89.99 on the region's best network. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Two-year agreement required. See store for details. A Johnson County deputy has been inside the Johnson Central High and Middle Schools for a month now, and Sheriff Dwayne Price says it's working out great for both the students and his deputies. Hey, they're saying they love it. Makes them feel good. Walk around, talk to the students. You know, it's, it's uh, you, you know, in the high school and the middle school, there probably are uh, kids that are afraid of the law, and, and a lot of them kids are kind of warming up to them where they see them there every day. They'll laugh, they joke, they shake your hand. I mean, it's, um, it's actually been pretty gratifying being inside the school. Deputies Terry Tussie and Kevin Pelfrey take turns at the schools during the week and have since mid-April when the Johnson County Fiscal Court secured the funding. And it was $50,000. It's enough to carry us through for, you know, two years, just having somebody there during, you know, school days. But if a situation arises when the deputy is needed at a different school, all the superintendent has to do is ask. And that's exactly what happened two weeks ago. There was a couple prisoners that had gotten loose from the uh, Lawrence County Jailer right in the front of a grade school, W.R. Castle. And it put everybody in panic mode, especially the school. They went on a lockdown. Deputy Tussie went to the elementary school and was there when a neighbor living next to the school saw the escaped inmate. She seen the escaped inmate walk by her window. So she called dispatch. Uh, dispatch got a hold of me and I got there within a few seconds. The inmate was taken into custody thanks to a deputy being at the school. And Sheriff Price says he hopes this program can continue for many years. And hopefully within this two years, something can be worked out to where it could, the money could be made, you know, for every year, you know, here on. I mean, it's good for the kids, it's good for us. In Paintsville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.